arms in. Going to warm up quickly, it's quite cold today. We got married in 1957. We had our daughter, Julie, in 1958. 1960, we had Trevor, and then in 63, we had David. That completed our family, which was nice. Well, we were a close-knit family anyway. We were proud of what they achieved. We were going out one day and his stepson and his wife's brother turned up and told us that David had come home. He, he said he didn't feel too well, he's going to bed and unfortunately he didn't wake up. You don't believe it because it was so unexpected. David, he was a courier and he used to pull up outside in his van and you still expect to see him when you see a white van or... And you feel why us? You think, well, it should have been me. I said it should have, should have been me. Following David passing away in June, Trevor, he came back from a cruise, ended up in hospital with pneumonia and had discharged him. And then he got worse and came back in and... And within six weeks, he was gone as well. We were in the same situation we were before. You just can't feel the sense of loss that you've got. And quite honestly, you feel like giving up. You know, we'll never forget them, but when you go to bed at night, and the first thing you think about is the two boys and what you did. But we had each other, didn't we? So we had each other. And we had our daughter. We take each day as it comes and carry on. I first found out about senior saints when a friend of ours, she used to go at Mary Oak. And she kept saying to me, why don't you come with me? And in the end, I talked Tony into coming in as well, so that we do something together. Steady, Tony. March it out. Paul takes the sessions with the help of Jack. Turn to your left, and then walk around. Keep him well? Yeah, yeah, all right. You know the rules. If you two are talking, you're not walking fast enough. Oh, come on, sorry, quicker. Sorry. That's perfect, Tony. It is very relaxing and you meet people there as well. You get friends with and it's reassuring that people care. I've got osteoarthritis in my knees, but doing these sessions, that is easing the pressure and the pain is getting a lot better. If you're all feeling fine, you're in the wrong place. <laughs> The mental aspect of it as well, in relation to taking our minds off, I lost a few moments. The former counselling, so I can get rid of some of my frustrations and feel better for it. Bring it back. Paul and his staff are very caring, and they're there for us if we want them. We've had new people come, they keep coming back to these sessions, and I think that's a reflection on how useful these sessions are. Yeah, we give us a big clap, I don't want thank you very much. It's very important to keep the session going. Saints Foundation are doing an excellent job and I hope that it helps other people as much as it's helping us.